I think the patients who come to see us have life-threatening or for sure life altering conditions and so yes we can help them and a lot of times we can improve their quality of life also extend their life so that means we've done 10,000 open heart surgeries that's rarely done in this country anymore where two surgeons would achieve that volume be in an institution for that long remain partners for that long and so in that sense too it, it really does speak to what's been built here and what we've been able to accomplish over a long period of time and i think that means that we've hopefully helped quite a few people, you know, maybe have a longer life or a better life. It's, it's satisfying to know because that is a lot of work. You know, that's what we're here for is try to help other people out in our lives and you know, make our lives better, but also that, uh, hopefully make other people's lives better by what we do. I like the support, you know, administration support, but also the support of all the different physicians always there to help us out whenever we need help and hopefully we help them too. Uh, but it's a very collegiate uh, community. Also nursing staff and uh, in the operating room and the, the ICUs are very helpful and on our side and help us out. And the techs in the operating room are incredible. And we've got a lot of people that have been working with us for many, many years. But it's not just John and I. It's rare to have this stability, this continuity, and this quality for this long a time period. What we do is physically hard. A lot of people don't get to where we are at our age and still be as active and, uh, and doing the volume that we're doing. But we couldn't have done that without Coxell. We couldn't have done that without this hospital, this system, the people we work with, and the patients appreciating what we do and trusting us. So it is, it's a rare accomplishment that speaks volumes for, for at a lot of different levels.